So lastly, let's say I actually now wanted to do something specific for some, some specific word. So I've said, if the answer is yes, open the window. Well, what happens if the answer is yes with a capital Y, or if it's no? What happens if I want other choices for what people put in, rather than if it's something else at all, do it. And the way to do that is with else if. Okay, so else if, I'm gonna say, answer equals, and this time I'm gonna say two equals, um, yes with a capital Y, and then I'm gonna put a close bracket on it. And then actually what I'm gonna do is copy this lot from here. So control C and then control and V to paste that in. So I'm saying is if it's yes with a small y, open the new window. Else if it's yes with a capital Y, open the window. Now I could keep on going there. I could say else if just Y or else if just capital Y um, or else if OK. So I could put in here lots and lots of these with lots and lots of different versions of the answer and have at the, e the end an else, which is if none of the answers you put in make any sense, then just put in the OK some other time. So now if somebody puts in yes with a small Y or yes with a capital Y, both of those should launch the YouTube video. Anything else that's typed in there will give, bring up the message, okay, some other time. Okay, let's test that. So I've saved the changes. And if I type in yes with a small y, that's working. If I type in yes with a capital Y, that's working. If I just put in capital Y, doesn't work. If I put in no, nothing happens. I'm going to refresh that so it comes up and put it in again. So now I've got my JavaScript is helping me make a choice. I'm sending information from the button. I'm saying if what the person has typed in is yes, so if it's yes, open the window. If it's yes with a capital Y, open the window. Else, so if it's not yes with a small y or yes with a capital Y, if it's something else, then write OK some other time on the screen. So now I've got a little bit of JavaScript which is making choices. It's doing different things depending on what somebody types into a box.